Hello, this is Remax Realtor Wes Garrison, the Garrison Brothers here at Remax Town and Country. I wanted to make a quick video, which I often do. Most of my videos are based on actual experiences that I have with people, with buyers, with sellers uh, in the day to day. And I try to cover them really quickly in some videos because <clears throat> they're very common questions. And they're really good topics to talk about. And I had an experience this week where I have a house that's a listing that's available on the market. And there were some things that came up that I was discussing with the sellers. Uh, things that make the house easier to sell because they're saying, why isn't the place selling? There's a couple of quick things that we did. I think the first and the most important thing is don't overprice your house. A lot of us, we want to get as much money as we possibly can far above market value, that would be great, that'd be fantastic, that'd be ideal, but in the law of economics, you realize that the market will tell you what the worth of your house is. If it's priced right, it's gonna go really fast. If it's priced too high, you're not even gonna get a showing. So finding that sweet spot, that exact price based on a competent realtor, giving you competent CMAs, competent comps, boy, that was redundant, competent comps. Um, setting the price of the right is going to have a whirlwind of great results for you if you do it up front. You're going to get, often, we often set a house up and we don't take offers for the first 10 days. Uh, we create that sort of that auction-like environment and we get lots, of, if it's priced just right, we'll get a lot of offers and we'll get a pile of offers. At the end of the 10 days, we can look at all the different offers we can choose which is the best one. So it's absolutely important. Don't overprice your home. Let the realtor tell you what it's actually worth if you really want to sell. If you're, if you're a motivated seller and you really want to sell, that's the number one thing you can do to make it go fast. Another thing that uh, is, is a very innocuous, it seems it doesn't make a big deal, but it really does make a big deal, is having lots of family pictures around. I know you, you, you decorate your house, you've got pictures on the on the hallway walls and on the tables and everywhere and it's really great and it's really quaint and it gives you a very homey feel but you have to open up the space to let people imagine what it would be like if they were there themselves and having a lot of family pictures has such a mark of personal ownership that it doesn't allow a lot of times the buyers to come in and just have you want very clean walls you want a very clean space very minimalist space and by removing a lot of those family pictures it makes all the difference in the world because they can actually imagine their family in the house now um, the last point which is kind of a touchy point makes that a lot of people really get is when the house is being shown it's absolutely important that you as a seller are not there on the property during the showing. Uh, that can create a lot of tension, that can create a lot of awkward moments, um, asking a lot of questions. A lot of times in my experience that actually scares the buyers off. They feel pressured, they feel like they have to answer to you. Don't be there. Don't be there when you're on the when you are having your house shown. Um, a good competent realtor will coach you on that, will let you know that ahead of time and set the expectation and set the structure so that that is, that is a, uh, a way of, of being when you're selling your house. So those are just a couple of quick points that I found just made all the difference in the world. Now, we, we, in this particular house, we priced it right to begin with. Uh, we're actually still in the first 10 days. Um, so, and we are getting offers because it is priced right. Um, they removed a lot of the family pictures and made all the difference in the world because they had just repainted the house a year ago. And the walls are still in good condition. They cleaned a lot of things up. And... Um, they understood that they didn't want to be there anyway. So they just wanted us to let us do our jobs because we're great listing agents. We're just going to go in and we're going to show the, the, the buyers the house and we're going, to, we're going to go out. So thanks for watching. We'd love to help you. If you want a good realtor, look up the Garrison Brothers on Google or YouTube. Look up Scott Garrison, look up Wes Garrison, and you can see all the great marketing that we can do for you. If we can do that for ourselves, we can certainly do it for your house. Call us anytime.